Welcome back to this video. In this video, I'll show you on how to install Google Message in Android. So let's see. But before we dive into the tutorial, if you find this tutorial useful and you are following me to this channel, remember to click on that subscribe and on the notification bell for more useful tutorial like this. So with that being said, let's get started. The very first thing you need to do is to head over to your Play Store. So I'm going to click on here to open my Play Store. After you open up your Play Store, next thing you need to do is to simply click on Search from the bottom side right here. Now the next thing you need to do is to come to the Search Apps and Game and type in Google Message. Then click on Search and it's take you right here. Next thing you need to do is to simply click on Google Messages. Then you have it right here. So as at the time of making this video, 5 billion plus have successfully downloaded and installed this app. The next thing you need to do is to simply click on install. So after a successful download and install, next thing you need to do is to simply click on open right here. Then the next thing you need to do is to click on continue with your Google account. Then click on set default SMS app. Then the next thing you need to do is to click on Messages. Then click on Set as Default, just like so. Then you can also click on Start Chat right here. So right here, you can start chat with your contact on your phone, or better still, you can chat with email, or you can create a group chat right here to start a conversation with Google Message. This app here is a very great app that you can, that you can really enjoy on your phone it's as simple as that then click on agree and with this app you can simply back up your messages you can recover your deleted messages then you can also you can now use apps rcs chat with others you have them too you can turn on these features you can turn these features off anytime from setting so simply click on got it and allow everything to synchronize with your phone without any stress. I hope you really got value for this video. If you find this video useful, give this video a big like. And also, remember to subscribe to the channel for more useful tutorials like this. Thank you so much for watching. And I hope to see you in my next video. Bye for now.